This chicken is so amazing. It's not quick and easy. It's a few steps you have to take, but it will change your life. Do it for your taste buds. Okay, this is Audra. This chicken is looking so good. It's sizzling. A picture just wouldn't do it justice. So what I did was, yes, I made my wonderful little cornbread muffins, but I kept this in the crock pot for 10 hours. And then I baked this so the outside is nice and crisp because I'm a texture person and the inside is like totally falling off the bones. It's seasoned to the bone. And then I boiled some potatoes and I made my mashed potatoes. My mashed potatoes taste amazing. And then my cornbread muffins, they're gonna be so pretty. I'm gonna plate this so beautifully. And now I just gotta get my turnip and mustard greens. I love these chicken quarters. Not only are they super inexpensive, but they're very tasty and really versatile. You just can't mess them up. The leftovers are amazing. Okay, now look at my mustard greens. I did mustard greens heavy on the turkey next. Um, I always put some Rotel, gives it flavor. These greens are stronger, have a stronger flavor than collard greens. Look at these. They are delicious. And look at my turkey falling off of the bones. These are extremely tasty. They're tasty. It's wonderful. All right, so with my chicken and cornbread and mashed potatoes, we got dinner on deck. I absolutely love my pressure cooker. If you do not have one, you must get one immediately. I prefer turkey tails over turkey necks. That's what's in these greens. Now, the only way to make mashed potatoes is to boil you some potatoes, honey, and mash them with a little milk, butter, salt, and pepper. Yes, honey. I didn't get a pretty picture of my plate, but these are my to-go containers for my girlfriends. Thank you. Now, let's make it happen.